Hi there. Jamf Routines allows Jamf for Mac and Jamf for mobile customers the ability to create automated workflows from templates and connect certain tools in their environment to Jamf Pro. So let's explore how to use Jamf Routines with Jamf Pro. To start, navigate to jamfroutines.com and sign in with your Jamf ID. Currently, we have no Jamf Routines, but when we do, they'll show up here for us to review. To create a new routine, click Create in the top right. Here we have a list of all of the available Jamf routine templates, with the most popular routines right at the top. An integration with Slack or Teams allows admins to get a notification when a specified event occurs, such as when a computer policy completes successfully or a mobile device is unenrolled. For our example, I want to create a routine that restarts mobile devices based on a specific schedule. Let's use the Filter field to help narrow down our search, and once found, click Select. First, let's give our new routine a name. I'm naming mine Points of Sale Restart. Under Trigger, we have the option to have this routine start because of a Jamf Pro event or based on a schedule. I'm choosing Schedule. Next, we have the option to specify a time and time zone for the routine to run. In the Repeat section, we have the option to select which days of the week we'd like our routine to run. For my example, I want this to run every day, so I'm leaving them all selected. If this is your first time creating a Jamf routine, we'll need to create a new connection between the routine and our Jamf Pro instance. To do this, click Jamf Pro. Let's enter the required information by giving the connection a name, entering our Jamf Pro URL, and entering a username and password. Please note that Jamf Routines does not store our username or password information. It's used to create an API role and client within our instance to manage this integration. When ready, Click Save, and a new integration is created. Now, choose the name of your connection from the Jamf Pro menu. Finally, in the Mobile Device Group menu, choose the group that you want this routine to be run on. With all of our options configured, click Save. Now our Jamf Routines homepage shows our new routine, including which routine was selected and the number of times it has run. To edit a Jamf routine, click Edit. We also have the option to disable or delete a routine if it's no longer needed. Be sure to check out the Jamf Routines documentation linked in the resources for more information on Jamf Routines and its requirements. Thanks for watching.